Hello again. I'm back with another look at your full forecast. Temperatures across the state getting cold very quickly behind the cold front we saw move through yesterday up in the panhandle already 22 in amarillo 26 in lubbock up in the big country already down to 34 degrees 39 here in san angelo and then further south in the state still holding on to 60 degrees even down towards harlington harlington texas forgive me now overnight here in west texas all of us expected to see temperatures dipping into the 20s more of the lower to mid 20s a few outliers is going to be in the upper 20s like Comanche expecting to get down to 28 overnight 23 expected up in Abilene as well as here in San Angelo getting even colder once you look towards Big Spring and Big Lake they're going to see overnight lows at 20 degrees and wind chill values looking to be even colder getting into the teens for everybody a 14 degree wind chill expected Friday morning in Abilene 15 degree wind chill here in San Angelo getting even colder towards El Dorado a 12 degree wind chill ozona going to see that coldest wind chill value of all getting down to 11 degrees as that wind chill so well, like we talked about before wind chill is actually how cold it's going to feel so we are headed out early for your morning commute getting the kids ready for school dress in layers that's going to be a very important and keep those layers on throughout the day because friday's high really only getting towards that 50 degree mark a few places still holding on to the upper 40s by saturday seeing more of the mid to upper 50s but won't quite start to feel like normal again and so Sunday when we start to inch closer towards that 70 degree mark right now we're looking at this high pressure that's at the moment entering the pain handle that's going to drop south overnight impacting us here in West Texas to kick off the Friday that's why we're going to see such sunny skies so even though it's chilly it's going to be a nice sunny day that high pressure is going to start to move east throughout the day on Friday by pushing farther east out of the state by Saturday morning but what we want to look out for over the the next several days is this low pressure system developing off the west coast that's going to make its way towards us by the middle part of next week bringing our next chance of rain and another cool down in temperatures so to recap all of this which is seven day we're going to hit that 70 degree mark again by sunday temperatures getting over that 80 degree hump to kick off the week next week but once that low pressure system that we just looked at starts to make its way towards us we're going to see that chance of rain around wednesday temperatures getting back into to the 70s and eventually back into the 60s by this time next week. Back to you Esmeralda.